The Elmira YWCA hosted their annual Youth Summit in Elmira today. The 2015 Why Hate Bullying Prevention event gave area students a way to see how bullying affects classmates and also how they can put an end to it. WNY's Nick Quattrini was at the Youth Summit earlier today and brings us a story. Nick? More than 100 students from eight different area schools came together to create dialogue about bullying and how to combat it. Students also came up with new ideas to find ways to work together. The students were presented with the results of a bullying survey. The survey gathered input from area students regarding topics like how bullying starts, cyberbullying, and intervention. Afterwards, the students came up with solutions and put together an action plan. Some of them also shared their thoughts on what they can take from the summit and how they can implement it in their own schools. We're the people that see it firsthand. It happens to us. So if adults can see that we think there needs to be a change, then maybe they'll start taking action. And you could see today when we went over the results of the surveys, some of them you could tell were shocked by some of the results, but at the same time, some of the students said, yeah, that's exactly what I thought it was going to be. So bringing it to light for the students, and we made sure that all the administration had a copy of it as well. So it's bringing it to light to the schools as well. Now that survey was given to 380 local students. One topic covered was cyberbullying. According to that survey, text message, Facebook, and Twitter were the most common means of cyberbullying. Reporting in the studio, Nick Quattrini, WENY News.